Welcome back to my little channel. Now yesterday I made a video on Twitter trying to tell people how to use language. I think that's the best way of saying it. It's a form of, of, of language control, thought control. And where the video wasn't offensive other than it proves how negative these companies seem to act, especially Twitter in this case. Um, yeah, sure, it was an interesting video. And then I get a message from YouTube that one of the people that follows me, Mugeschichte, has responded to the video. So, curious as I am, I click on the bell from YouTube to see how Mugeschichte responded. But there's nothing there. So I open the video. There's nothing there either. So I go to the whole thing from YouTube itself. Maybe it's a comment and I need to allow it. Sometimes that happens. They think that something is, how do you call it, spam. And then you have to admit it, allow it to be posted. But there's nothing there either. Not thinking much of it, because I have no real idea what the post was, I'm like, okay, whatever. Then I check my Gmail account, because my YouTube account is linked to my Gmail account. And in the Gmail account, I have a mail from YouTube telling me that Mugge Schichte responded on my video. And in that Gmail message, I see the whole post of Mugeschichte. And now you can see it too. Well, race and ethnicity are basically interchangeable. An ethnicity is a group of humans with similar phenotypical traits that they give to their offspring, usually also a common culture of some sorts. And Hell, the definition of race and subspecies is a group of individuals within a species with common phenotypical traits that they give to their offspring. You could basically see some nations as their own race, even tribes within that nation like the Sephardi or the Ashkenazi Jews. You can differentiate them visually better than many subspecies in other non-human species and for example the, the visual differences between some horses or some dogs are far less than the visual differences between some ethnicities in homo sapiens sapiens fair enough i had to no i didn't have to clarify but i, I wanted to clarify that you can differentiate them visually better than many subspecies in other non-human species I think that is because humans are evolved to be able to cluster persons into group of related individuals or genetic similar individuals to better judge if someone is of their tribe or not. It could also be just a side effect of pattern recognition. Now, I'm going to respond to what he said, um, but before I'm going to do that, YouTube. Can you tell me why this post was so offensive? Can you tell me why this had to be removed? <laughs> Obviously you're not going to tell me. I know you're not going to tell me. Just like Twitter. You want people to realize that you have to talk and think the way you want them to. But you're not going to clarify why that is. Or what it is you mean. Now, Mugge Schichte, um, I disagree with you on a few points though. I mean, race and ethnicity are not interchangeable. I mean, we use them interchangeable, but they're not. Now, if we look at humans, uh, there may be different ethnicities, but it's still the same race. So there is that. And, and in all fairness, there are differences. Yeah, sure there are. There are differences within the same ethnicities as well. But we cannot pretend that therefore they are of a different race because they are not. But yeah, sure, YouTube, feel free to explain to me what's wrong with this text. Is he 
incorrect in recognizing that there are physical differences between the different ethnicities. These differences are so clear that, for example, in America, certain ethnicities are being considered their own race because the differences are so visual. What I'm telling everyone, and in this case, as my response to Mugishik as well, yeah, no, those differences are really visible, but it doesn't make them different races. And even if he were to say, well, they're all different races, he's saying it in a perfectly responsible and, and correct way. There's not a single insult, not a single offense to be made from his post. What's going on, YouTube? Are we not to recognize that there are different ethnicities? Are we not to recognize there are different cultures? Do we have to pretend every single one of us is the same? Because I've got bad news for you. It's not true. Even people within the same ethnicity are not the same. Humans are not a monolith. People within ethnicities are not a monolith. People within the same culture are not a monolith. There is no hive mind. Can you please stop this nonsense? It is offensive, really, because basically they are telling you what you are and are not allowed to know. Now, if I found this post so offensive, it should be up to me to remove it from my feed. But even I wasn't allowed to see this in YouTube? What am I? A child? Do I need protecting? Because, oh my god, someone is talking about the Sephardi or the Ashkenazi Jews. Maybe that's the reason, because the, we said Ashkenazi Jews? Had he said Buntu, would that have been different? Or if he would have said uh, Koi? Would that have been different? I mean, they're not Jewish ethnicities. These are African ethnicities. Then again, that probably wouldn't be allowed either. It, would it have been better if you would have used terms like Slav and um, Germanic? Um, Germanic obviously being too big a term. Uh, maybe we should have said Frank and Slav. Would that have been okay? I, I simply cannot understand the stupidity of it. I mean, you're not allowed to recognize reality because it's not the reality we want there to be. Anyway, like, share and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Criticism, as always, is more than welcome and I look forward to what you have to say, what you think, and obviously why. Now, I can't promise you that YouTube will allow you to but um, if, your, if your post isn't under my channel, trust me, it's not because I didn't want it there. If I don't want it, I'll tell you I don't want it. <sighs> oh well, criticism is always more than welcome and I uh, hope to see you all next time.